ought to is a modal verb that is similar to should, except you have to use to after ought. When these two words are said together quickly, it sounds a little bit like oughta. Ought to or oughta. In spoken English, oughta is very common. As I make this video, you'll probably hear me say oughta. You ought to see a doctor. Ought to is often used for situations requiring medical help. The main verb is see. You could replace ought to with should. Ought to see a doctor, should see a doctor. They have the same meaning. The verb be is the main verb in this sentence. They ought to be careful. The verb be is often used with ought to. The government ought to provide more help for those people. Here's the main verb, and there's an obligation on the part of the government to do something. In this kind of a situation, ought to is a good choice. When you give recommendations or offer some advice, I think comes before ought to with that subject. So when talking to another person, start with I think and then you. I think you ought to take a break. To make ought to negative, put not right after ought and then the infinitive. Remember that you can't split an infinitive. It has to be together. So here's the infinitive. They ought not to do that. It is possible, sometimes you'll hear this, that you take off to. They ought not do that. That's fine. In American English, and I think in British English, it's okay to take off the, the word to. And it is also possible to make a contraction and say oughtn't. This is something I don't do and many people don't do, but you might hear it. Here's a good example of using ought with the negative without to when it's the verb be. We ought not be late. If you put to here, we ought not to be late. That's also fine. I think it's just a matter of personal preference. We ought not be late. Use ought to when there is some sort of expectation. She ought to be here soon. Here's the main verb. You expect somebody to arrive very soon. She ought to be here soon. The team ought to do well this season. Here's the main verb, do. It's, again, possible to use should. The team should do well this season. There's an expectation this season based on the players or the performance of the team. Ought to is often used in simple expressions that we're all familiar with and ought to do it is one of those. So if you say that ought to do it, it's very similar to saying that's, that's enough or that's all we need. There's not a need for anything else or anything in addition to what you already have, that ought to do it. Something's finished. Here's another fairly popular expression using ought to. We ought to be grateful for what we have. We're grateful because we're fortunate to have food, shelter, clothing, 
safety, a good life. The main verb is be, ought to be. We ought to be grateful. 